So you guys were one. I'm hearing all you guys. You guys were one of the theme song shortened. So here we go. This girl reviews movies, games, and books. Sometimes she plays them. So does that. And when she does it with the cat, does that make her crazy? Does that make her crazy? Probably. <laughs> so, it's shorter. There you go. <laughs> Crazy Cat Lady Gamer Reviewer, or Martha Butler, does not own the any trailers or pictures. I use them under fair use. Educational for edu and entertainment purposes. Hi everybody, well, we're going to review Goofy Movie today because my movie is now 25 years old. Oi! Yep, me and Max had a great um, time going on vacation, even though he didn't want to go on vacation. We did it. So, hope you guys enjoyed this review of it and have a great time together with. Martha, boy. So, I can wear this, guys, since this is what basically what Max wears when he um does one of the songs in the movie. And I don't have a skateboard. I don't have a red um hoodie like he does. So this is what the best we're gonna have to deal with. So. If you were born in the 90s, you knew that you were, you were around the 90s and you were a kid in the 90s like I was, this movie was really great. It's a real, and if you watch it again, it's really nostalgic. And watching it as an adult versus it watching it as a kid. I may not have kids, but you understand what Goofy's coming from, and you also understand what um, what Max is going through during this movie. Goofy, even though, I think the, if you ask me, I think the principal kind of overreacts to the situation. Yes, he did just interrupt a uh, assembly just to impress a girl, but I think some, I think some adults forget what it's like to be a kid and how nerve-wracking trying to impress either a girl or a guy to like you is. And Max probably thought that's the best way to do it. Since Power Line is based off of um, pretty much a, a lot of things back in the 90s like um, NC Hammer, um, Dave, um, Dave Bowie, any from every single like um, guy out there who was just a dancer who was just singing by themselves. Probably for you guys, it's probably, um, I guess, I'd rather not say this, but only person I can think about now that probably be, be like a representative of it is that, is, um, is, I can't even remember his name because I'm not a big fan of him, but if anybody, you could think about anybody who's just a dancer, yeah, and he thought he was a game member. As far as we know, we know that, I don't know, we don't know if our, if our line is a game member or not, but thing is, yep, anybody who's a good answer nowadays, so, and, they, and this, this is, there's a lot of 90s in one, and the next one is a lot more 90s than that, and, than this one, because this one, he does skateboard in it, and the same that we have a different actor here who plays um, Max than who plays him in Goop Troop. I don't know if the same exact person who plays him during a screen goofy movie, but he's definitely accented by a guy here, and in Goop Troop he's played by a girl because he's younger, I guess. And he's about to leave school, about to like go on summer vacation, and apparently there's a concert going on in LA. And that's, and there's also a party that he wants to go to with Roxanne. We may not, we don't see Roxanne that often, but, because uh, I think the only time we get to see Roxanne is, um, we see her a little bit in the, in the new DuckTales episode. I think episode two, there's a picture of her 
with um Goofy, uh, when he, Goofy's showing um Donald his pictures, and he's al she's also on at least one episode of um House of Mouse. So that so besides that's when we get to see of her in this movie. Besides there and see in this movie, she's not even in the next one because. She probably went to a different college than Max. So, Max is... Well, I like both Max and Roxanne because both of them are a nervous wreck in these in this movie because they don't get... They're both clueless about how their feelings are because they're teenagers. And they're both trying to get the other person to like each other. And... and I like how at the end of the movie... Roxanne says, I already liked you. You didn't have to go to that concert. You didn't have to lie to me. I already liked you. And you still yell at Max like, Dude, you don't need to be doing this to yourself. She likes you already. So, yeah. And basically everything like that. And poor Goofy is just trying to be a good dad, listen and listening to dumb, even listening to, um, to guy like Pete here, who is a hard ass dad, and thinks that he and thinks that all he has to do is get his son PJ to respect him. There's more to that than to being a parent than just getting their respect. You need their love, and I think. Pete doesn't see that, that you, you just need both love and respect. Otherwise, when they become an adult, they won't no longer want to be around you. So, yeah. So, I think eventually Goofy got that. And, and he also got to learn, he also had to learn that he had to let the kid go, which is can be hard for a parent. I know it's I never, I'm not a parent, but I know that can be hard. And stuff like that. And these songs are somewhat catchy, even though they're not as um, memorable as the other Disney movies out there. And I like the fact that there's kind of um two cameos of Mickey and Donald uh, of Mickey. There's only one cameo of Donald because Mickey's and Donald both appear on the highway. Well, Mickey is at the PowerPoint concert, and the audience. He's, it's like a blink in your miss thing. He doesn't even talk because it's during the song. Uh, listen to each other's eyes song. So, and that one's like the one that's probably the most catchiest. You see it eye to eye. So, and, hmm. So, what do we give this? Movie Goofy? Boy, I give, we give this movie a, um, a 10, 9 out of 10. Boy, Salvi, Salvi, Salvi. Here, kitty, 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 kitty. Salvi. Here. He didn't want to come this time. So, here's all he went, Goofy. That's all he went to give it. I give it up for pie! I'm a deal! Don't get Solly. Don't get, don't get Goofy. yo -hoy! So, I'll see you guys later. Like, share, and subscribe, and happy 25 years old, Goofy movie.